I was elected to get things done. I was elected to fix, to fix what is broken. I was elected to fix what is broken. And my government and I are determined to do just that. Oh, Mr. Speaker, God. at the beginning of March, the Minister for Finance will come to this House to lay out in the national budget the details of our economic policy and the clear roadmap that we have laid out for taking the country out of its current predicament and onto a sustainable path of recovery, jobs creation and prosperity. I am absolute in my confidence that we have the program, the competence, the commitment. Order. And the goodwill of the people. And the goodwill of the people to turn things around. By the grace of God, we will succeed. And I believe this House knows it too. Mr. Speaker, in the immediate term, targeted legislative policy and institutional reforms will have to be undertaken to unleash the suppressed potential of the economy and allow Ghanaian entrepreneurship to rise and thrive domestically and internationally. For too many young people, unemployment is sadly the reality of the start to their adult life. For years, for generations, it was assumed and guaranteed in this country that the quality of life of every generation would be an improvement on that of their parents. We are now faced with the phenomenon of parents looking on in frustration as their grown-up children remain at home without the means to strike an independent life by themselves. This generation of Ghanaian dares not be the one to reverse this natural trend. We must create the atmosphere that generates jobs. We must boost the, econ the confidence of the private sector to invest in the economy. We must have the courage to start building our future and take the hard decisions that need to be taken to grow our economy. We have no choice but to reduce the budget deficit and cut waste in all sectors of public life. We must complete the formalization of the economy. Order, order. The process for a comprehensive national identification system and a property titling system will be completed this year. That will boost confidence in our, in our country and increase investment from nationals and foreigners. Then we'll be able to generate jobs. We must boost the confidence of the private sector to invest in the economy. 